In this video, we will be answering the question, what is a radian? So we'll start with a circle. I'm going to construct the radius. And then measure that radius. And we see that it is 3.83 centimeters. Now I'm going to take the radius and rotate it 1 radian. Now if I measure First, I need to construct the arc and then measure the arc. You can see that the arc length is also 3.97 centimeters. Now, if I change the size of my circle, keep an eye up here on the measure of the radius and the measure of the arc length, you'll notice that the arc is always the same size as the radius. So by definition then, a central angle which measures one radius will subtend an arc that's equal in length to the length of the radius. Now we can uh, rotate our radius again. One radian. And again, one radian. And again, one radian, and again. And then one more time. Now this is a visual that there are two pi radians in a complete circle. We know that pi is approximately 3.14, so 2 pi is approximately 6.28. Now if you count the number of central angles which measure one radian, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then a little bit more. That's uh, a visual of the fact that there are approximately 6.28 radians in one complete circle. Usually we talk about it as 2 pi radians equal 360 degrees.